What do guns mean to America? No more guns! We will not comply! Never. We will no more gun control! I was selling guns. I was building a gun company. But I believe in an immense corresponding responsibility and safety. Something that I think is way out of whack in the country that the marketing practices that the NRA and the firearms industry were engaging in lead to these kind of outcomes. Guns are intrinsically tied to masculinity. The data shows six of the country's deadliest mass shootings in the last four years were committed by men 21 or younger. Gun sales go up after mass shootings. Yeah. They essentially serve as advertisements for the, for the weapon. According to an analysis by ProPublica, 15 of the nation's largest firearm sellers, like Daniel Defense, used Google systems to place ads that generated over 120 million impressions before and after a mass shooting. From the late 1960s to today, the NRA went on the offensive in ads, in speeches, in TV appearances, pushing the narrative that you have a Second Amendment right to own a gun, and the government's trying to take it away from you. Their goal is to eliminate the Second Amendment and our firearms freedoms so they can eradicate all individual freedoms. We're seeing more and more people carrying guns, using guns. It is the wild, wild west. Police say that they are seeing more guns than ever on America's streets. 500 million firearms possibly on the streets of America right now there. What drives gun sales? Fear. The NRA says, okay, let's go. Racism, conspiracy, hatred, fear. Let's use it to gin up voters. The highest gun sales period in our nation's history, the last 18 months, coincides with the most fearful, tumultuous political and cultural time of our history, at least our, our modern history. There's a couple different types of flags that we saw on January 6th. We saw Trump and American flags, and then we saw the other type of flag we saw were come and take it AR-15 flags. Right-wing political radicals in this country now are driven, are owned, they use guns as the central symbol of their identity. This allowing Kyle Rittenhouse and others like him to march into streets and intimidate others with armed, um, loaded rifles. marketing does do enormous harm. We've seen the results with uh, white supremacists using these weapons to target and kill black Americans. Gun sales will continue on this high pace as long as we're in this sort of really ugly environment where we hate each other and where half of the country seems to be arming itself for civil war against the other half. And there is no civility when one, when one side is standing over the other with a loaded guns. <laughs>